The Pearl Jam song, Jeremy, might bring back memories for some, but for one mother, it's like reliving a nightmare. For the first time, she's talking about the song and, and its connection to her son's death. News 8's Cynthia Seguirre has this WFAA original. It is very relevant in America today. It was the tragedy that sparked a song and a controversial music video nearly 30 years ago. Jeremy by Pearl Jam. That day that he died did not define his life. Wanda is Jeremy's mother. He was a son, a brother, a nephew, a cousin, a grandson. He was a friend. He was talented. On January 8, 1991, her son walked into his English classroom at Richardson High School and shot himself in front of his peers. In an instant, everything changed. I was at my office, work. And what was your immediate reaction? I didn't believe it. I was in shock, not my son. I was going to pick him up that afternoon at school. Even now, his mother is not sure as to the why. How did you get through the fact that it happened in front of children? I didn't think about it. I mean, you literally go into a fog. That's me, always right next to my friend Eric. Brittany King was Jeremy's classmate. This was a big wake-up call, like, you know what? Life is not all hunky-dory all the time. Real things, tragedies happen. She was 16 and he was almost 16 in January of 1991. And it made me grow up pretty quick overnight, literally overnight. Brittany remembers it like it was yesterday. Shock and fear um, went into my mind. Uh, all the students we ran to the back of the room and kind of huddled together. Then, Brittany made a split-second decision that will forever haunt her. Should I look? I remember thinking that, should I look? And I did. I looked. I just out of, just, I don't know why. I don't know why I looked, but I did. And um, I'll never forget. I will never forget it. A newspaper clipping about the shooting at Richardson High caught the attention of Pearl Jam, and the rest is history. But I was angry at them for writing that song. I thought, you don't know, you weren't there. That story's not accurate. He drew this in, in 1982. When you walk into Wanda's home today, Jeremy is everywhere. It's his best of shows ribbon, he won First prize at the Texas State Fair. He won best of shows. And this is all before he was, you know, 12 years old. He drew this award-winning picture of an elephant when he was just seven years old. Jeremy clearly had a uh, gift. This is the room where we meet each Wednesday night. 12 years ago, Wanda decided to move on by helping others. She started leading a grief support group at her church. When you see school shootings now, what do your eyes see? I think of the mothers. I think of the sisters. I think what will be said or what opinions will be thought about the student. But it's the mothers and the sisters that I, I want to wrap my arms around and tell them that someday it'll It'll be better. That was Cynthia Aguirre reporting. If you or anyone you know feels hopeless and needs someone to talk to, call the National Suicide Prevention Line. That phone number is 1-800-273-TALK.